Fall River man has been arrested, accused of attacking an 82-year-old man. Police say this happened at the Rotary by North Main Street and Airport Road in Fall River Tuesday night. So witnesses on the scene allege that 27-year-old Aiden Courtright did this, all because the victim was holding a Donald Trump sign. Alexander Leslie is joining us with the story. Alex, that victim is now speaking out. Right, though, 82-year-old Charlie Chase was sent to the hospital for his injuries. He has since been released. He says when this all happened, he just froze. Now, Tuesday, Chase says he was holding a Donald Trump sign when a car drove up and a man started screaming at him. Chase says that suspect, later identified as Aiden Courtright, ran over to him and screamed at him for the sign. He says Courtright got physical and ended up tearing the sign in half. But it didn't stop there. A witness says Courtright lifted Chase up, then flung him down. Police also allege Courtright kicked Chase with leather pointed shoes. Two other witnesses were able to tell police what happened when Chase was transported to the hospital for bruising. He says he believes nobody should be attacked for their political views. If you've got something, listen to what they're saying. Figure out whether you agree, you don't agree, or hey, some of that's uh, good. Maybe I should change some of the things I think. That's the American way. Now, police were able to contact Courtright, and he ended up turning himself in. The 27-year-old is facing charges for assault and battery on a person over 60, in addition to other charges, as well as a civil rights violation. Live in Pawtucket, Alexandra Leslie, Eyewitness News.